Thank you for joining me for yet another unboxing video. And today we have more Pathfinder RPG goodness. This time we have flip tiles, campsites. Contains 24 full color map tiles, wet, dry, and permanent markers erased from the tiles. Of course, this expansion is brought to you by the great people over at Pazio. Who's on watch? Flip Tiles Campsites is a standalone expansion suitable for use with any flip tile set. With 24 full color double sided 6x6 six six inch tiles stunningly crafted by cartographer Jason Engel. Whether your group is exploring a remote wilderness, stuck inside a sprawling dungeon, or simply trying to avoid spending money at an inn in their city, these campsites will help you plan out your evening. Suitable for experienced game masters and novices alike, this product fits perfectly into any GM's arsenal. Wet, dry, and permanent markers erase from the tiles, and convenient packaging makes for easy storage. Why map out every single campsite by hand when flip tiles can do it for you? Highlights include forest clearings, swampy aisles, hilltops and lodges, deserts or tundra, dungeons and caves, and urban camps. Remember, each double-sided square makes changing the scene as easy as flipping a tile. This expansion was released in 2020, of course, by the great people over at Pazio. For more information about Pazio or about Pathfinder, go to pazio.com backslash maps. And of course, the price for this expansion is $22.99. So, let's crack this bad boy open and see what kind of goodness we have on the inside. And you'll have to excuse me every time I open up a new flip tile. Sometimes the contents are stuck inside, so it takes a little bit of work to get them out. So it doesn't happen on the first try, but it did. I was going to say, you're going to have to excuse me for a minute while I try to get it out of the box. Now, the first thing I always do when I get new flip tiles is I bend them just a little bit. I do that so that they kind of, sometimes you hear that squeak just kind of helps to unstick them just a little bit more. It doesn't bend them, doesn't hurt them. It just, what you call it, makes them a little less sticky together. All right, so let's take a look at these. So here we go, we got a campsite. Very cool. Got another tent, some trees. Excellent. Got some sleeping bags hanging out there. So again, if we make this into a little camp that we have here, like this, use this as the example. Oh, we slide that better into focus right here. There you go. I have a couple figures I'm going to put out here. We have a standee from Starfinder. I'm going to put him out there. Boop. Got another figure from the Starfinder range. Put him out here like this. Boop. And I've got two unpainted miniatures from Dungeons and Dragons. I'm going to put them out there. And it's a sneak attack at your camp coming out of the forest. These creatures are crawling out of the forest, coming to get you. Again, why am I showing you these figures? Just to show you how well the figures pop on the maps. And of course, um, you know. You, if you have other trees, you could put actual trees that you have there, you know. Um, you could, if you have tents, you can put the tents out there too. There's different expansions for that, that you, you know, for, from other companies that create the different 3D terrain pieces. You can put the terrain on top of there, exactly where they're placed. So this way it pops even more. But even without that stuff, obviously the figures look great on these maps, whether they're painted or unpainted. All right. But as always, I want to remind you that the figures are not included in this expansion. They're there for uh, just to show you examples of what it would look like. Again, that's that one with that in the back. And here's this one with this in the back. Okay. Got some more. We've got a bigger campsite. Some rocks falling over here. Now, if you, have, if you again, if you, these tiles do not have to be used for Pathfinder. So if you're into using uh, different kinds of horror-based um, RPGs, like Slash or for, uh, what's another one that's out there? 
you want to use it for alien or for aliens versus predator or whatever. Someone's on a campground, you know, space lands in the forest. You're running around the forest. You know, it could be a, if there's a, you know, you want to do a, uh, make your own um, miniature game where you're using um, Jason in the woods and in a campsite. These are the perfect tiles for that. And of course, you want to use it for Dungeons and Dragons or whatever. You could use it for that, for Aliens, the RPG, Starfinder, uh, Star Trek, whatever you want to use it for. These tiles are good to go. I don't know if I put my sleeping bag head first towards spores, but that's just me. It's kind of silliness right there. Got some stanchions. You're gonna put your head down at night, and these things at night come alive. You got a new, a whole new adventure right there. Again, you can use these tiles with all the other ones that Pathfinder or that Starfinder or any of the other um, tiles that have been released. You can combine them together, and at the end, in each corner, it tells you has a letter, uh, letter and some numbers. FO3 on this one here, which indicates that's for the campsites. And uh, so, if you combine all these tiles together, and your friends want to help you set, you know, take it apart at the end of a session, and want to help you clean up a bit, just say, hey, just put all the FOs together. And you got yourself quicker time cleaning up. Very handy when you have a lot of tiles on the table. Makes it a lot, lot easier in terms of cleanup. Really great quality, high detail, just pretty fantastic overall. Yeah, guys are sleeping inside cabin. Oh, here comes Jason out of the woods. So again, do you need to use it all the time? Got a little campfire brew in there. Do you always need it from uh, use it for Pathfinder? No. Whatever your whatever your creativity comes up with is what you can use them for. But again, this is a beautiful set you have here. This is really really cool. Really captures the vibe of being outside in the wilderness. Very very cool. And oftentimes when I'm playing games, uh, you know, you use one tile from one set, another tile from another set, and you kind of combine them together because you don't need all these tents. You know, I don't have 9,000 people in my, uh, you know, in my, my parties when I go out. So you only use the tiles that you need. cool out in, the, out in the winter setting that's cool I like that yeah, very cool very very cool I've got some palm trees on this one that's cool I like that's a little different You're getting a winter scene right there and that, ladies and gentlemen, is everything that's included in this unboxing of Pathfinder, Slip Tiles, Campsites. Contains 24 full-color map tiles, wet, dry, and permanent markers erased from the tiles. Of course, brought to you by the great people over at Pazio. As always, thank you so much for joining me for this unboxing video. If you enjoyed it, you can always give us a thumbs up or leave a comment below. We'd love to read your thoughts. Also... You can always hit that subscribe button. This way you're kept up to date as to whenever we release new content to the page. As always, thank you so much for joining us. Be safe, be well, enjoy the remainder of your day. We'll catch you on the next unboxing video.